Mountain Lion getting a little bit comfortable in the city of Petaluma. There's been a number of sightings in the last 24 hours. The big cat even showed up on surveillance video right there in someone's front yard. KTV's Deborah V alone joins us live tonight. And Deb, I know you went into that neighborhood. I can imagine residents keeping their uh, head on a swivel here. Yeah, Mike, people are saying they'll take their walks closer to home rather than up in the open space. Police here usually get maybe one of these calls a year, but this has been a flurry in 24 hours. So it jumped up over this fence from the backyard down into the front yard. A mountain lion has this West Petaluma neighborhood buzzing, spotted about 6 a.m. in Arlene Luchok's front yard. Well, what I thought was a really funny looking uh, big dog. Her security camera and her own eyes confirmed that was no dog. It's a huge cat, it's a huge cat. And my husband was like, what? And he looks out the window and he says, that's a mountain lion. I said, yeah. <laughs> The area is a quick walk to downtown, but with hundreds of acres of open space nearby. Two more sightings in the afternoon have police keeping up a presence, making sure people are aware. It's pretty creepy, to be honest. I have a three-year-old, so I was just thinking about all the possibilities of what could it go wrong. With a mountain lion, you want to be big and noisy and look like you're not tasty. It's kind of unusual for them to show themselves and they're, they're pretty sneaky. Petaluma police say their first call came late Tuesday night from someone driving on 101. It actually crossed the freeway and the, the motorist almost hit the, hit the cat. Responding officers spotted it in an industrial park, but it gave them the slip. We thought we had it contained in an area and we did call him a control out, but it, it got through our containment and, and disappeared. And assuming it's the same cat, it had to have dashed across the freeway again to get into this west side yard. Police strategy is to be hands off and try to herd it away. To try and direct it to go, you know, back up into the hills and to basically leave it alone and not get involved with it unless it's cornered. The Luchoks, with some plants toppled and their vegetable garden trampled, still can't believe their close encounter. I'm certainly going to look out the window a little bit longer before I step out early in the morning going to work. <laughs> Why so many mountain lions being spotted in the Bay Area? Experts say this is the time of year they migrate, searching for food and water. The thinking is that they're going further than usual, Mike, due to the drought and declining deer populations. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see just how many sightings we have this, this summer during the drought. All right, Deb, thank you for that.